Let's fly to Seek Valley on my thrash. God damn it. Hello everyone, welcome back. This is immediately after part 16. I'm recording again. Uh, now that we've dealt with the neck lord, let's go ahead and go up top to see if anyone wants to talk. I don't know why I didn't read that. According to Kasumi, Kasim and Hazel, Hazel has been placed in charge of northern defenses and is, are, is presently building up his forces. The Imperial Army's forces are nearly 8,000 strong under Kasim Hazel, another 6,000 soldiers in the floating fortress of Chara Chazarazade. Chazarazade. And 10,000 troops in, around, in and around the Imperial Headquarters. With what we've got, Kasim Hazel's army is all we can handle. The only way we can win is to unite the rebel forces around the country. I happen to be an old friend of Joshua, commander of the Knights of the Dragon's Den, whose domain is in the west. If you plan to befriend them, I'll come with you. The Dragon Knights have always rejected Imperial jurisdiction, preferring to maintain a neutral status. Should they join us, our forces will be formidable, but I must warn you that Joshua is a proud man. The only chance of an alliance is for you, Ma Commander Nico, to visit them in person. Nico, if you're going, so am I. Alright. The Dragon Knight's domain lies northwest liberate of Liberated Ante, formerly known as Beer Blanc. Alright, so for one of the people we have to recruit, we need Moe's, Moss, and Mies. And they are in the Warrior's Village, so I'll see you there. Alright, in the Warrior's Village, if we go to the Armor Smith, I believe? So, we meet again. How about another game? If you win more than 5,000 bits from me, I'll join you. Oh, Marco. Alright, I got this. Look how fast that goes. Did you track it? I sure as hell didn't. First try! Wow! Okay. You're good, young man. You win. Well done. I'll keep my promise and join you. Neat. There's Marco. Are you Moose? Howdy. Good work. Got some work? Boss Moose Moes. You've all joined the... I think he's supposed to say Meese Mo Moes because he's Moose. You've all joined the Liberation Army. Master Nico. If they believe in you, so can I. Let me join. Alright. I'm gonna go back to the castle. Be right back. Okay, now I'm back. Um, I think I spent like half an hour in the castle. Right now I have 40, 40 minutes of recorded footage, which is interesting. This is my team set up right now. Yamku and Taiho are needed for some recruitment. Uh, Humphrey Flick are kind of stuck with me and I only have Camille because she's weak and I want to level her up. The items we are going to need is the flower seeds, the blue, red, and yellow. And if you've been looking at the... <clears throat> if you've been looking at the general shops, in every town you've been to, you should be able to buy them outright at your, uh, here. So the next place we're gonna go is Klon. Klon. 
one place. Oh, and I walked around and turned in the sound settings and window settings, so now I have this with cat sounds. Where he at? Back here? Oh, is that you? Good, good. Now I can finish my work here. Thank you so much for the seeds. There we go. So now I'm a member of your party. Cool. Um... Now I will see you at... TN. Okay, now I'm back, and the person we're looking for here is Ike. Ik. I remember seeing them. I don't remember where. Oh wait, never mind. They're down here. That's right. Ike. I'm Ike. I'm a martial arts master. I have respect for only the strong. Are you strong? Whoa, you are indeed. I can lend you my strength. I was waiting for someone like you. Let me join the Liberation Army. Thanks. Alright, and next place we're gonna go is the Pirate's Fortress. Uh, or no, we'll go to Recon first, then the Pirate's Fortress. Actually, can we... Where is this? Okay, Pirate's Fortress first. It is this town right here, or it's this tile right here. I uh, I was exploring and I accidentally found this place. Uh, there's no initial cutscene, as far as I know, and we got some recruits here. Hi there. Hey, Anji. You're just wasting away. Why don't you give us a hand? Wasting away? Me? Watch your mouth. I'll show you who's wasting away. Get ready to fight. Sure. Alright then. Leonardo, connect. Don't pull any punches. Let's not pull any punches either. This is not going to get annoying. I love it so much. Luckily, most of my menu wing I cut out. Oh, that didn't do anything to them. But that did.
Not bad, Taiho. Sounds like fun. I understand how you feel. Let's teach those Imperials a lesson. What about you two, Leonardo and Kanak? If you go, we go too. Of course. Yeah, you need Taiho and Yamku in your party in order to recruit those guys, apparently. And now I will see you at Recon. Alright, in Recon, we're looking for a girl named Lote. Lote? Lada? Wait, is she the one missing the cat? Yeah, she's the one missing the cat. The cat is in Kaku. Alright, ignore whatever I said. We need to go to Karaku first to get the cat. Now that we have the cat, we can go to the top floor of the inn to get lo lo lottery. Oh good, here she is. I looked all over for you, Mina. Thank you, Nico. Her name is lo My name is Lot. Lot the Magician. As a gesture of thanks, I'd like to join you. Cool. And now... It's time to go to the Dragon's Den. Okay, I just, uh... Went to Quran, and uh, it looks like or Garen, G A R A N, and the woman who said we need thirty-seven more people. I think we just collected those. She's like, "All right, I'm in." And betting on the Liberation Army. Glad to be of service. Cool. That's cool. Now we gotta go to the Dragon's Den. Hey, it was just straight up west. Okay. Hey, guy. Beyond this point is the domain of the Knights of the Dragon's Den, as, de as designated by the Emperor. No one is permitted to enter. I am Humphrey Mintz, former captain of the Imperial Army's 100-man battalion. I request a meeting with Commander Joshua of the Knights of the Dragon Den. I have orders from the Commander of the Dragon Knights to let no one in, not even the Emperor himself. Not even the Emperor? Those are very strict orders. Now, be on your way. What do you think, Nico? I think so I think something's happened. Let's see if we can gather some information in the nearest town, Ante, to the southeast. Let's go to Ante! We're an ante. Trying to eat and run, eh? You scoundrel. No, no, no. You are mistaken. Your lack of trust is so typical of peasant stock. What I'm trying to tell you is that you have the honor of being owed money by me for a little while. Think about it. I, Vincent de Bol, of pure aristocratic extraction, will owe you money. You should be happy. Don't give me that cock and bull. If you're an aristocrat, why can't you afford breakfast? Ah, that is indeed a painful question. You see, if I had some money, I would be glad to pay you as much as you'd like. But unfortunately, I just gave it all away to some poor starving children. Liar, you're no aristocrat. Hey, what's going on? Shut up! 
Oh, why? It's the leader of the Liberation Army, Master Nico. Nico? Are you... Are you not Nico McDull, son of General Teo McDull? Permit me to introduce myself. I am Lord Vincent de Bold. At present, vacationing in these parts. Aha! We are both of fine stocks. Let's fraternize on the more casual basis. Now that introductions are out of the way, may I impose on you for a moment and ask if you might lend me a few coins? It appears this fellow here doesn't trust me. I am presently on my way to meet Joshua of the Knights of the Den Dragon's Den. As I am in a hurry, if you'll excuse me. What the hell was all that about? Did he just say going to the Dragon's Knight domain? Excuse me, I wonder who's going to pay for his meal? What? Thank you. But that swindler did say he was going to the domain of the Dragon's Knights. Let's go! You are very persistent. I can't let you in. What a thing to say. I'm telling you who I am for your sake. Vincent here is a dear friend of Joshua's. If Joshua finds out you turned Vincent away, he'll be furious. You're new here, aren't you? There's still time to do the right thing. I've been in this post for five years. Oh, I see. The last time I was here was a little over five years ago. Tell me any more lies and you'll be sorry. Haha, <laughs> he's at it again. Why, if it isn't my dearest friend Commander Nico. Have you business with the Dragonites too? Well, you're wasting your time. We'll never get past his hard head here. But we must, but we must see Joshua. You look familiar. Why, it's Humphrey, one of the most renowned captains of the Imperial Army's 100-man battalion. Here in the Libera Re Liberation Army too? Commander Nico, dearest friend, I have something good to tell you. Please follow me. Ah, nostalgia. I would come to the Dragonite's domain to play when I was a child, so I know the area well. You can enter the domain from behind this rock. I played in this spot often as a child. This is a way in? Indeed, you're quite right for a commoner. Heh, listen up aristocratic scum. If this, is the, if this is an entrance, why didn't you use it yourself? That is a foolish question. A man of my birth would never sneak in like a common burglar. That's quite enough, gentlemen. Oh, Nico, my dearest friend, you believe me, don't you? Good, good, I wouldn't want to... I wouldn't know what to do even... If even you distrusted me. We'll be very careful then. It'll be quite dangerous inside. Ooh. Spooky. Oh, there's a flying naked guy. Oh, and uh... I made sure to equip everyone with runes. Uh, I put the champion's rune on Camille, the killer rune on Yamku, and the water rune for Taiho. Humphrey has the earth rune. So yeah, we should be fighting some very powerful enemies here. Oh man, I'm out of tea. I think after this battle I'm gonna go get some tea. Woo! 
Oh, we had some low levels. I completely forgot. That's fine. Godlet? Goldlet. Interesting. Like a gold bracelet? Alright. I went ahead and ate. Got the dogs. Oh damn, I forgot my tea! The only reason I left was to get the tea. Alright. I hope the dogs calm down. But I got the tea. I ate. I let everyone out. All the dogs, all the cats, I let them outside. They went around and played. It's pretty cold outside. Let's just continue in the dragon's den. Below magic shields. Let's just try and free will. Man, my hands are cold. That kind of reminds me of, uh... That attack that the magic shield used reminds me of the, uh... Hey, look, a book. The disc thing that Krillin likes to throw in Dragon Ball Z. And I'm loving how fast I'm able to level now. Oh, we're almost level, almost level 50. Look at that, Nico's level 49. I probably could have used a regular medicine on that last guy, but it's whatever. And I love the cold, but... <clears throat> hey, the cave is widened. Where are we? What's the matter? Look below. Below? Whoa! What are you doing there? Who are you? Rather brazen for thieves, aren't you? We're... Nico! Hey, it's Futch. Sorry for all the walking around you here in the background. Don't you remember me? It's Futch! I'm the one who took you to the Magician's Island on Black's back. What are you doing here? Nico? Then you're the Liberation Army's leader? Why are these dragons sleeping? Are they always like this? Mm hmm? What business does the Liberation Army have in our domain? Aren't you going to answer my question? I am Humphrey Mintz, former captain of the Imperial Army's 100-man battalion. I would like to see Commander Joshua. Alright, now that you've seen what happened here, I must report to Sir Joshua. Thank you. Uh... I'm Milia, Deputy Commander of the Dragon Knights. Thank you, Lady Milia. Please lead us. When you emerge from the cave, you'll see the Palace of the Dragon Knights. I'll run on ahead of you and inform Sir Joshua of your arrival. Let's go, Futch. Actually, is there any chests? Oh, this just leads right back up here. Okay. Okay, these don't sound like elephants. Why couldn't they use, like, some form of those audio? Oh!
On our master Joshua's arm is the dragon rune, one of the 27 true runes. That's why he never grows old. It's also because of his curse. Or, it is also his curse. We at the dra we the knights of the dragon's den have always dealt with the Imperials as equals, and vice versa. But recently, their attitude towards us... Roots, you... You're Humphrey, aren't you? Commander of the Hundred Man Corps in, the in those days? What's going on? Back then, you fought for Barbosa against my master, Emperor Guile, and now you turn against Barbosa? Barbarossa? Wishy-washy, aren't we? In those days, I believed in the Emperor Barbarossa. Then why are you now in the Liberation Army? A change of heart? I haven't changed. The one who changed is... Roots, I have a request. A request for me, a former foe? Our forces are still vastly inferior to the Imperial Army. We need all the support we can muster. You were Guile Rugner's greatest general. You should be a great help. Please join us. My only master is Guile Rugner. But if this is an opportunity to kill Barbarossa, the killer of my master, then it's an appealing thought. Alright, I'm with you, Master Nico. <clears throat> I don't know why it's so hard for me to read right now. And then... Time to go upstairs. Sir Joshua, these are the men I was telling you about. Humphrey, it's you, is it? Been a long time. Yes. I was so worried about you. After that incident at Kaleka, you vanished without a trace. I had my reasons. Joshua, this is Commander Nico of the Liberation Army. So you're Commander Nico. I'm Joshua, Commander of the Knights of the Dragon's Den. I've heard a great deal about the Liberation Army. I have come to discuss with you an important matter. Important matter? What is it? We need your help. Please let me. F oh, we need your help. Please let me fly a dragon. Help your army? Is it- it is true that many of us have been dis dissatisfied with the present emperor. Is there a problem? Something to do with their sleep, perhaps? So you've seen them. I tried to keep it a secret but barring the gate- er, by barring the gates, but... A few months ago, the dragons fell asleep and have not awakened since. We tried everything we could think of, but to no avail. Never awakened? At the moment, the Knights of the Dragon's Den are completely powerless. We brought many doctors here, but no one was able to cure them. We sent a man looking for Lu Lucan, who the people call the Holy Doctor, but he has disappeared recently. So you think Lucan can cure the dragons? He's the finest doctor in the land. He can probably find a cure. Nico, this is our chance. He'll end up always owing us a favor. Hmm? It's nothing, never mind. Fuma! There's someone named Fuma here. Yay, a new window. I wonder if it's gonna be dragon related. Is Fuma out here? Yeah! So, you found me. You must have remarkable powers of vision to find me. When I can obliterate my very presence and become a shadow. You must be. Ah, the leader of the Liberation Army, I see. My name is Fuma, follower of the Ninja Way. Please, let me join you as a member of the Liberation Army. Honored, sir. Hey, hidden book. 
Alright, time to go back to the castle. Alright, we're back and we have Lucan in our party. You were Master Lucan. I had no idea you were a member of the Liberation Army. Please, sir, will you take a look at our dragons? Of course. Um, um, um. How are they, Master Lucan? This isn't a disease. They have been poisoned with sleeping poison. Not a disease. No, oh, somebody gave them poison. I had a feeling somebody sneaked into our domain. Is there a cure? I can prepare an antidote, but I will need certain ingredients. Moonlight weed, black dragon orchid, and... What is the other ingredient? We'll leave it till later. First, guess those two. Commander Nico, there should be some moonlight weed in Seek Valley. Seek Valley? Sir Joshua, the only... The only dragons awake are Fudge's Black and my own tra Thrash. I will take Nico and his men to Seek Valley on Thrash. Good luck, Amelia. <clears throat> Commander Nico, let's hurry to Seek Valley. I guess I'll wait here for the ingredients. Meet Commander Nico. Thrash is out front. Okay, she's a uh, medium, so we're good. And I, I, I like decked out that old man too. Okay, the dragon's here. Whoa, Master Nico, let's fly seek through. Let's fly to Seek Valley on my thrash. God, damn it! Look at all those obstacles we're avoiding. I'm not even controlling the dragon. This is like our airship. Seek Valley. This is Seek Valley. I don't see anything that looks like moonlight weed. Must go deeper in the valley? Ooh, a master robe. Cool. Oh, I thought that was a hidden path. Ooh, blacksmith. Hey, guy. Mace, of fucking course. Who are you people? What do you want? If you got no business with me, go away. Liberation Army? You fellows still lack the power to change the world. If only this castle were a little bigger. Oh, fuck you, old man. So stingy. Okay, so that is two people we have to wait till our castle upgrades in order to get. Ooh, a chat. I kind of want that. <clears throat> Ooh, red ivy. Dead Ivy. Ha <laughs> I got him.
Okay. More sound setting. I wonder what sound that's gonna be. Elephant? I mean, a uh, dragon? Oh yeah, seriously, I kinda wish I could put the champion rune on him, on Nico. It just make things easier on me, I guess. Or harder, whichever. What are you? What the hell? Uh, it's Final Fantasy 7. Oh wait, no, never mind. That's Crisis Core. This is different. I didn't buy everyone medicine this time. Does that just not do damage? How much damage it takes to break a crystal. Like that time I think I did over 600 damage since the, the uh, previous crystals were broken and there's still two crystals. Maybe I got them this time. I think after this episode I'm going to change the sound effect for the menuing because I feel like that's going to annoy some people. I personally don't mind, but... Oh! He's got like... a couple phases. Let's just free will it. He might be close to dead. Or he has more health than he ever had before. Ooh. Okay, interesting. Flick's just gonna attack them. Alright, we- yeah. Oh! I didn't think two people would die. I thought Humphrey was still fine. Oh well. <clears throat> Uh, 
Doesn't Clay Guardian heal? I thought it did. Maybe it just raises defense. Oh well. You got this. I got this. I still got this. Nope. Oh, oh, I still got this. Hell yeah! Hella clutch! Oh man. Nice. I only gained one level from it. And a good amount of bits. Wyvern. gold necklace. Can Eileen wear that? Oh. Who wears the jewel jewelry? Oh. Ah. Okay, cool. Seeing some old bosses. Or an old boss. Could this be the Moonlight Weed? Probably. That's Moonlight Weed, alright. It used to be restorative. Or maybe it is, I don't know. I think I read that wrong. Who's that? Come on out! I'm impressed you made it this far, but I can't let you leave with the Moonlight Weed. Whoever you are, we've had a rough time getting here. We're taking this stuff. Oh my, what an energetic young man. But I'm talking to Nico right now, so please be quiet. Nico, you must be getting tired of the Liberation Army game. You will give me the rune on your right hand, the Soul Eater. Don't look, don't look so angry, Nico. I won't force you to give it up. I have something more elegant in mind. Come out, Ted. I thought so. We didn't see Ted die. It's been a long time, Nico. I'm sure... You sure were cruel to leave me behind on my own. But I forgive you. We're old friends. Now will you give me back the rune I lent you? I was able to live 300 years because of that rune, so I need it. Please give it back. Nope. The rune. Yeah, just did them both. Is that ain't Ted? Can you hear me? I don't have much time. A strange connection remains between the rune and the one who carried it. That is me. I'm speaking to you through the rune. My body has been taken over by Wendy's Conqueror rune, and is no longer mine. The Conqueror rune will eventually take over my soul as well, and that is why I must hurry. 
Nico, you must promise to forgive me for what I'm about to do. What was that? Ted, hurry and take the Soul Eater! Please, Nico, give me back my rune, or else I'll take it by force. Nah! Oh, so you plan to fight Ted? And kill your own father, send your servant Gremio to his death, and now you want to fight your best friend? How sinful you are! Soul Eater, I spent 300 years with you. I know all about you. The meaning of your curse, your evil intentions. On the day I lost my home, you stole the souls of everyone I knew in this world. During 300 years of wandering, you caused great many wars and plundered countless souls, including Odessa's and Nico's, Nico's father and Gremio's. You took them all. You steal the souls of those closest to your master and, and grow in power. Ted, what are you talking about? Hurry up and get the Soul Eater! Having the Soul Eater near me has given, it, given me power. Just enough power to move my own body. Now, Soul Eater, I command you as your former master. Take my soul now! That's a good, or that's good. Who needs a body that can't be controlled? I now return the 300 years of life that you gave me, Soul Eater. Damn it! Unbelievable! I have to. Detestable creature! I'll take that room from you someday. Don't look like that, Nico. I chose my path. I think it's farewell for sure this time. Take care. Live your life to the fullest. For my sake, too. Damn. This must be the moonlight weed. Everyone is waiting. Let's hurry and take some home. Let's see what Judgment does. Ooh. Oh, nice! 1500 damage? I hope that works against the boss. Unlike pretty much every other fucking thing this room does. Don't listen to me, I lied. We need to go talk to a uh, person here. I think Joshua? You're back, Milia. Yes, Sir Joshua. Here's the Moonlight Weed. Next, we need the Black Dragon Orchid. I'm ready to go anywhere in the world for it. But there's a problem. What is it? Butch went alone to Greg Minister Palace to get it. The only place where one can obtain the Black Dragon Orchid is the Floating Garden at Greg Minister. I shouldn't have... I shouldn't have mentioned it in front of him. Ooh. Hey Black, you got no one on you. Oh. Oh, hey. Okay, wait here, Black. I'll be right back.
Damn, there's so many that I don't know which one is the Black Dragon Orchid. Hmm. This one looks most like the one that Lucan described. You're right. That is the Black Dragon Orchid. Who is it? That is my question, young man. You must be aware that this is the Imperial Garden. You're the uh, Emperor. I never thought I'd run into a flower thief in a sleepless night. Judging from your outfit, you must be a Dragon Knight. He, he, yes, your highness. I'm Futch, the Dragon Knight, ninth class. An apprentice. And what might you be doing here? I I came to get, get a Black Dragon Orchid, your <laughs> highness. Please let me go. I really need this orchid to wake up the other dragons. Dragons? It must be windy again. Young man, you must leave immediately. Y you'll let me go? Hurry while I still feel generous. Yes, your highness. Ooh, that was really close. Uh, that really was, must have been the emperor, that sheer presence. I hope I got the right one. But he sure was different from all those rumors. He let me go and... Oh well, now that I have the Black Dragon Orchid, I'd better hurry home. Right, Black? Oh, I'm just in time. H who are you? I've already got the Black Dragon Orchid. Bye! What an uncouth boy. You should be punished. Ah! Elephant noise! Oh my god. Butch. Butch. Are you alright, Butch? Wake up, Butch. I must bring back the Black Dragon Orchid. Ahem. It appears you're awake. Huh? What? Where am I? Where's the orchid? Don't worry. When we found you unconscious in the forest, you had the Black Dragon Orchid in your hand. We had a hard time prying it loose. I see. Then the dragons... Yes, I made the antidote from the three ingredients and gave them to the dragons. They should be awaking soon. Thank God. Dr. Lucan, what was the third ingredient? A rump? The third ingredient? Is something the matter? I'll tell you. The third ingredient was a dragon's liver. And it came from... Not... Not my... Black. I'm afraid that was when we found him. Black was already dead. Hate me if you want, but we had no choice. But, but Black. Commander Nico, Joshua's dragons have awakened. Let's go to Joshua's cut orders to draw up an alliance pact between the Liberation Army and the Dragon Knights. He should agree to help us now. You're right, he hasn't committed an alliance yet. Heal me up, lady. Thank you. Commander Nico, on behalf of the Dragon Knights, I thank you. Well then, Joshua. It looks like we'll be fighting together again, side by side. But against a different enemy this time. Commander Nico, the Dragon Knights will join you to defeat the Empire. Now we can finally return to Lothar Castle. I can't stand the smell of dragons. Humphrey, I have a request. Request? Come in, Futch. You know what this is about, Futch? 
Yes, sir. A dragon knight who has lost his dragon must leave the dragon's den. Now that you have lost Black, I cannot keep you here. I understand, sir. Black probably died to save my life. Butch, don't blame yourself. I'm alright. I just want to believe that Black saved me. Humphrey, will you take Butch with you? He won't have to worry- I won't have to worry about him if he's with you. I understand. Thank you, sir. Commander Nico, when war breaks out, we'll rush, we'll rush to your aid. Master Nico, Master Lucan wanted to return, so we are about to fly him home on a dragon. Would you and the rest of your men like a ride too? Fine, I will be waiting out front with Thrash. Butch, take care. Someday you may be able to return. Yes, sir. Hey, don't look so depressed. I'll teach you how to use a sword. Master Nico, if you're ready, I will fly you home on Thrash. <laughs> That worked so well with the music. What are you talking about? Don't trust my instincts? Your instincts? Don't make me laugh. Thanks to your instincts, we almost got captured by Imperials, remember? Hee <laughs> hee. I wasn't quite myself that time. What's the problem here? I'm saying that I have a hunch. He's a spy for sure, that's why he won't talk. That doesn't necessarily mean he's a spy. What's going on here? Oh, er, uh, welcome back, Sir Flick, Master Nico. Hehehe, <laughs> how ladylike of you to be in How ladylike you try to be in front of Nico. But for you, it's a lost cause. <gasps> she is a girl. Watch your mouth, you rat. What the? You're back. Was your meeting with the Dragon Knights a success? Uh-huh. Did you manage to secure an alliance? Don't worry, medical officer. It's just Humphrey could be a little friendlier to others. Uh-huh. By the way, who is the silent fellow here? Kasumi? And Kryn captured him hanging around the castle. He refused to say anything, so we were waiting for you to come back and decide what to do with them. Nico, are you the commander Nico of the Liberation Army? Thank goodness, now I can complete my mission for Master Warren. I kept silence because I was under strict orders not to speak to anyone until I met you face to face. Chasm Hazel Chasm Hazel took over the northern defenses after Taya McDowell has recently begun to apply extreme pressure on rebel factions. He's looking for a comeback. My master Warren is a famous man of wealth in the north, long respected even by the Imperials, but as a man of honor and generosity he harbored many fugitives in his mansion. As a result, his home was surrounded by Chasm Hazel and his troops. Master Warren and Sir Victor, who just happened to drop by, fought hard against the Imperials, but they were eventually captured and taken prisoner. This is what Master Warren told me to tell you. Commander Nico, Victor is one of our most powerful soldiers. Warren, despite his wealth, is an, an, is an honorable man with a large following. We must go and rescue them. At present, Chasm Hazel's troops number more than 8,000. And, they, and they're a trained army, whereas we're just a ragtag bunch. Commander Nico, despite its name, the Liberation Army is not a unified army. To continue fighting in the future, we need to give the troops more proper military training. I agree. Let me make the necessary preparations. I suggest you retire now, Commander Nico. You have a busy day ahead. Alright. This is where... Hey guy, you, uh, you good? You having fun up there? I figured that was just touching the ceiling, but I guess not. Whoa! Wait. 
No. It just on the ground. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that just looks weird. Because my feet disappear, but his don't. <laughs> What's going on? Okay. I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. I have another two hours of footage, but I'm going to say we went through another chapter of the game, the Dragon Saga, you know. Uh, next time, we're going to go rescue Victor, hopefully. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.